Hi, <clears throat> this is size 14, grub hook, barbless hook and the bead I'm using is a gold tungsten 2.8 millimeter and thread I'm using is black A2. As usual, wax your thread. I'll explain all the material as I go along. So just blow the eye, blow the bead, touch and turn. Open the thread and just go back up just to shape up the body. Open the thread again, come back towards the bend. All the way. That's fine. Wax your thread again. For the body I'm using is a goose tail <coughs> fibers. It's quite good actually. Um, I just took some off, so you need about a few strands, just according to the size. So just catch them. Take your time with this, these are a bit fragile and for the ribbing I'm using is a copper wire. This is a fluoro green. Just use touch and turn. Just keep it simple. Yeah, simple is always works better, you know. Open your thread again and then come back and just to make a little taper shape on the body. That's fine. And now just use a bit of super glue onto the body so we can have some durability. That's fine. Now gently bring these fibers. Take your time with this. You can use huckle plier if you can't get your hand around. So, like I said, you know, take your time. This is a great color for river. And that's fine. Now secure this. You turn. And then take this off. And all you have to do is just bring your ribs. fine. Just few turn. Okay, and add some marks on your thread. And I'm using this uh, fluoro green dubbing. Just uh, not too much, just a very little to give a little hot spot. And Make sure Let's take your time with this. And then we finish. Just add some varnish onto the thread 
couple of turns. And two, three, that's enough. So there we have simple goose tail river nymph. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.